This isn't a PR campaign for Boeing. What I want to know, what we want to know, is what happened. We've never been impressed with Boeing's training at all. In prior to the January 5th door plug blowout, uh, Boeing's training at their foundational training center was in really bad shape. Um, there has been changes, but I don't know that it's enough. You have a new workforce, you have training issues. Would you agree that was something that was evident for years? Yes, since COVID, yes. What sort of impression does that give your employees if you sideline them and put them in, quote, and I'm quoting, Boeing prison, a cage? I'm just wondering what message that sends. Yeah, I'm, I'm not directly involved with those employees. I have to refer to Ms. Lund's testimony yesterday. But, and I don't have the, enough details to, to know. Uh, I do know that... <clears throat> In a just culture, you need to address good faith mistakes with non-punitive solutions. And I know that we always take action to assure that the aircraft uh, product safety is protected. And we need, it's not an and, it's a both. There's a clear disconnect between the C-suite and the Boeing's workforce. And even more of a disconnect with spirit. We're concerned we're going to be right here again in a couple of years. Unless something, re a major shakeup occurs. And we'll see. What is a major shakeup to you? Uh, meaning a, a real transformation on safety.